What's cooking, everybody? I'm Baconopteryx, and welcome back to Out. Oh, fetch. Ignore that. Um. Welcome back to Outer Wilds. <laughs> uh, we're off to a good start. Me burning my marshmallow right off the bat. I'd say that's an omen. Let's see. So, again, don't really have a plan for today. I mean, I kind of do, but. You know, there's just so much to do. I don't know what I want to do. Old settlement. White hole station. Hold on. Let me just uh, look at these real quick. You know, always start off looking at the information we got last time. Every Nomai warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. To use a tower, you must be standing on the warp platform during the tower's alignment with its corresponding astral body. The alignment happens when the astral body is directly overhead. And there's more to explore here. Oh, what do you mean? There's nothing left to explore, I know. Old settlement. Oh, is this on Brittle Hollow? The Nomai constructed a temporary settlement beneath their crashed escape pod. The Nomai worked together to recall an eye-shaped signal they encountered while aboard the vessel. The signal is, was somehow older than the universe itself. The Nomai decided to call it the Eye of the Universe. There's more to explore here. Yes, yeah, so I've noticed that... The DLC for this game is called Echoes of the Eye, which really intrigues me. I think that's what it's called. Yeah. You know what? Now that I'm sitting here thinking about it, um, that reminded me. I actually do want to go back to Brittle Hollow because I was so close to Rebec and just didn't get to actually talk to them. So I want to try to do that real quick. And all right. So where... Those are the twins. That's a sun station. Sun station go burr. It move fast. Anyway, where's Brittle Hollow? That's Giant Steep. Brittle Hollow is back here. Oh, hey. For a second, I thought I was right there, and I'm like, nope. Anyway. Oh, hey, look. There's the quantum moon. I'm kind of tempted to try and land on it again. J just... Just because it said no one ever has doesn't mean no one ever can. Hear me out. Hear me out, y'all. Hear me out. Just, I'm not even going to look away. We are just doing it like this. If it disappears, then I'll accept defeat. Okay, yeah, it's not possible. <laughs> but, you know, worth one final shot. At least I think it was. So what's going on here? Brittle Hollow is mostly whole. Oh, flip. So what's up with this structure? Hey, y'all. That was a bit rougher of a landing than I intended, but it was still good. Uh, ooh, that exploded right next to me. All right, we're just going to hop straight out. So are these one of the ruins I've already explored? Was this gone before? No, I always explored over in the snowy area, didn't I? Oh, we got another a brutal hollow projection stone. Ooh. Wait, hold on, what was that? Just drop. Gimme this. What's about to happen? Oh. Was that what What is going on? Is this what they had built before? Is this what this place used to be? Not quite. Hmm, interesting. I'll leave that there. Unless, hold on, I'm not leaving that there. Come here. Thank you, thank you very much. I wanna see what you have to say for yourself. All right, here we go. Um, oops, that's the wrong one. Selenum. I'm at the shuttle. I'm ready to make my first pilgrimage to the quantum moon. Oops. Bells. That's exciting. You're almost ready. But there's still one more rule you need to learn. Come see me at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Oh, another thing. Interesting. Bells. The tower is on the opposite side of Brittle Hollow. If you follow the path west to the crossroads, you can reach the tower from there. Which way's west? Selenum, my gratitude for the direction spells. I'll see you soon. Okay, now I have questions. I have further questions. I now have additional questions. Oh, hey, look at this. Hold on, I found... 
things like this before. Also, where's Rebek? Right there. Okay. So I gotta move fast before things start collapsing again. But yeah, that only takes me up. That's unfortunate. Black hole is directly below me. Rebek's right there. So I've been like right there before, I think. Oh man, can I make that jump to right there? That's the real question. And will it kill me? No, screw it, let's find out. Okay, we're fine. Oh, there's still stuff over there that I probably should have explored, but I kind of really want to talk to Rebek first. Hold on. This thing's a lot bigger than I thought it was. Still suspicious about that being like a ship. Wait, hold on a second. What is that? That's like... That's like a thing that I don't know how to deal with. Uh, I'll come back to that, though. There's, there's just too much to do in this game. I want to know everything and everything at once. But it just makes it difficult. Alright, so... Is this where I was before? It's a lot darker here than it was before. At least I feel like it is. I could just be tripping, but I feel like with so much of Brittle Hollow collapsed last time I was in this direction, it probably was brighter. Hold on a second. What is going on there? Oh, I am nowhere near it. It's actually like way the flip over there. Yeah, I see him now. Alright, so... Real question now is how do I get there? Am I still high enough that I can... This black hole's not going to kill me. Okay, good. I I'm like very cautious about the gravity that thing produces. Just because the first time I tried to make a jump on this planet, it didn't, you know, go well. Like, this would be a sketchy jump. Where would I need to go? Oh, I don't like that. Alright, so I'm going to come over here. I swear I saw Among Us in that for a second. <laughs> Don't mind me, my brain just interpreting things in a stupid way. I bet this is not the way you're meant to navigate this area, but you know, this is how I'm doing it, so... Whatever. It glows. Is, does that mean the burning moon is right above me? Hollow's lantern. Alright, so what's this all about? Ah, I see. What if I go down? Does that go straight into the black hole? Am I not allowed to move while I've got signoscope zoomed? No, I'm not. I think that just goes straight into the black hole. So let's do this and see what's up. Uh, actually, that doesn't do anything. Wait, so how close am I to Rebeck? Rebeck, where you at? You're right. Oh, 107 meters. Huh. So you are, like, right down there. Huh. All right. I don't... I mean, I found you so easily before because it's, like... I had a very open path. Uh, don't break my legs. Oh, yes. This is where I landed before. An identified signal nearby. Yes, it's Rebeck. Gravity cannon, east 400 meters. Okay. What is this? Okay, so that that's that tower I was just looking at. I assume this is the gravity cannon. Don't know what this is. This is the dome. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I should explore this while it's still the hanging city. Ooh. While it's still, you know, intact. Oh, this... That's what the one I was like, I don't know what this is. It was probably this, the Hanging City. Ooh. 
So what is... What is all that? Oh, that's the tower thing. Oh, this must... Oh, I see. Hold on. I'm going to Rebeck first. I think that's how you get into that dome I found once many, many hours ago. <laughs> many hours ago. You know, this is only like my fifth episode, so it's whatever. All right, don't worry. I'm coming, Rebeck. That's so trippy. Yeah, all right, thank you. I'm actually going to talk to you this time. That hole is not going to destroy me. Ooh, and there's more stuff to be... I was in a rush last time. Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Is that what the thing is? Alright, anyway. Hey, Rebeck. Talk to Rebeck. Oh, you launched. That's great. Great job, you. Wow, I guess that means I've been out here a while, huh? Well, um, this is Brittle Hollow, but you probably knew that. Lots of history here. It's great. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm here to see the Hanging City. It's always been my dream to see it with my own four eyes, ever since I was a hatchling. An alien race lived in this solar system long before our species even existed. How could I not want to see what their civilization was like? Only... You've probably heard the others say it, right? I'm afraid of space. <laughs> Seriously, I'm more surprised than anybody that I'm out here. And do you want to know how I even got this far? I fell. I tripped over a gravity crystal. It's dumb luck that I landed somewhere my little scout says is halfway stable, instead of being sucked into what's below. I've been gauging the stability of the ground around me using my little scout, and this seems to be the place with the best surface integrity, so I'm just going to stay here until I'm ready to move on. Right. Also, I saw that piece of land fall in the background. <laughs> well, that's enough about me and my problems. You didn't come all this way to listen to me blather, did you? <laughs> That'd be... yeah. Oh. Uh, where should I explore out here? Oh wow, where shouldn't you explore here? Um, not the black hole, actually. And that's very no. Which is unfortunate because uh, most of the exciting stuff is all below the crust, including the Hanging City. That's just to the north. You can kind of see it from here. There's also this big dome on the South Pole called the Southern Observatory. You can't get inside from the surface. Trust me, I tried. But if it's like the rest of the Nomai structures here, there's probably a path to it beneath the crust somewhere. Good luck with exploring. Um, if you learn about anything about the Nomai, I'd love to hear it if it's not too much trouble. Let's see. What are you doing out here? Me? I'm an archaeologist, remember? Or, um, the archaeologist, I guess. Seeing as I'm all Timberheart Scott right now. Brittle Hollow is rich with Nomai history. That's why I'm here. This planet is an absolute treasure trove of culture, history, and science. If you have any questions about the brittle hollow nomai, I'm your Harthian. Or, um, I have some knowledge of them, I mean. So, maybe I can help? I learned something! Oh, cool, um, uh, what is it? I found a nomai escape pod on brittle hollow. Wow! So the nomai probably came here from somewhere outside the solar system, and they must have been in trouble when they launched their escape pod. But what kind of trouble? And where did the escape pod come from? Or launch from. I'm so curious. This is an amazing discovery. I hope we can find out more about why the no how and why the Nomai arrived. I learned something. Um, the old settlement. Isn't it amazing? Hard to believe the old settlement is still standing, but it's but there it is. It really makes you appreciate living somewhere like Timber Hearth. You know, somewhere that isn't being constantly bombarded with meteors and rocks and stuff. Okay, see you later. I finally got to talk to you, I got my oxygen back, and I got my ship log updated. Also, oh, I broke it. I feel bad. Oh. Oh. Yo. Okay. But what's down here? Oh, that's just the black hole. Gotcha. Alright, let me just... So what happens here? 
I wanted to go to the dome, but also I saw this, and, you know, I'm really curious. Also, the sky is open much more. I don't like that. I'm running out of time. Oh, wait, no. This is the thing I saw. It, oh, I don't know. Maybe this is where I should be going. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is the thing. This is the thing I just saw in the projection. Bells, be welcomed in this place. Above you stands the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Bells, if you are making your first pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon, ascend these stairs and obtain the last of the knowledge you need for your journey. Oh! I've been trying to get on there. I'm... I can't ascend the stairs. Unless... Hold up. Yes, I can. But I probably can't keep walking, can I? No. All right. Dang. What about this, though? This thing. Go up. Yeah, yeah it looks like it's taking me towards the top. You know, a little displaced. Oh, oh, thank goodness. I was like, hold up, gravity's still a thing. The Southern Observatory, 550 meters south. Okay, I can't remember which one's north and which one's south. The colors on the little globe. Uh. Surface integrity, 6%. Oh, so I need to move. This place is about to collapse, isn't it? Okay. Um, I should probably, while I'm doing this, uh, climb up the stairs carefully. Oh, there's trees. I don't actually know what I'm looking at. Here, is it's still 6%, okay, cool. Let me just, plume, the trees are moving. The trees in this grove wander about freely, the entire planet, roots, and all. This is not normal, even for this alien planet, and I never see them move. Is that even possible? Plume, if anyone else witnesses this disturbing behavior, I implore you, record your observations here. Either these trees are aberrant, or my brain must be. Thatch. Plume is right. The trees do move. I confess I didn't notice until I read his notes. Thatch. Alarmingly, it isn't only the trees. There is other matter in this area, such as that unusual shard of rock, moving in this e same eerie way. Felix. That rock is unusual for another reason, too. Thatch. It possesses color and texture I've never seen elsewhere on this planet. Felix. Hypothesis. This rock shard's presence is significant. We should study it. Could it be what is causing other nearby objects to also move about this area? All right, so what you're saying is I should... Ooh, what's this? Beneath your feet lies the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Oh, beneath now? Bells. If you are preparing to make your first... Oh. Descend the steps to the entrance below. Oh, come on. How do I actually get in there? That's so rude. That's so rude. Oops. Here, I want to launch you right there. That's actually not where I wanted to launch you. Launch you, like, right there. Okay. Ah, that's... Oh, we're going. Let's see how fast I can fly. Nope, I'm not going to make it anywhere else. Oh, or am I? What is happening? What am I doing? Did I actually... No freaking way. <laughs> you know, I can use all my fuel. That's okay. I just need to make it to like this or something. Oh, so close. All right, we're coming all the way over here. Is this... Oh, no, please let me into this. Oh, I missed! <laughs> Great. Alright. You son of a gun. Alright, look at all these beautiful broken pieces of Brittle Hollow. I'm guessing all the structures kind of disappear whenever that happens. Besides, I want to explore them in their natural habitat. So... I have been told that I should not just wait for this to happen. I should. Yeah, I see now. Um, 
here. Do 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 do. All right, I'm starting to run low on fuel. Let's just go in here. There we go. All right. Also, I'm gonna you know bring this back. I probably shouldn't have now that I think about it, but oh yeah, I read this before. So, what I think I want to do, I already looked at that too, is I want to do this, aim it that way, yes, alright, so like that, I guess, wait, hold on, do you just not stop spinning? Interesting. Okay. Let's see if I can actually get back. All right. Oh. Okay. I uh, I guess that happens now. Oh, so I'm up here. Ooh. Departure time. That. Return warp status charged. Step onto warp receiver platform to activate return warp. Hold up. That's what these runes are for? They're all... Are they all warp platforms? Huh. Whack. I'll take this now. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. So what about you? Dang. Now, I've read this too, right? Yeah. Warped in from the White Hole Station. I know as original design, yada yada. My ship is all the way over there. Alright, cool. So if if all those runes are warp stations, why is why does the white hole only take you to Brittle Hollow? Oh boy, my ship is in trouble. Is that the quantum moon? I want to learn how to get on there, dang it, but the you know, observatory thing is, or er, quantum moon tower is now kind of dead in the white hole. Maybe I could still explore it. That's, that might be a possibility. I mean, when I started recalling my little scout, it did kind of show that there was still something there. When I accidentally took a screenshot. Now then. Where to from here? I should probably hop in my ship. The planet's destroyed enough by now that I think I can afford to, you know, fly into it. <laughs> but like, what is this thing actually? Maybe I should just, here, let's try this. Uh, yeah, don't worry, I'm fine, I'm fine, it's all fine. Let's just, yeah, scoot right there. Center it. Alrighty then. Now, what are you? Oh, have I really used that much fuel already? Southern Observatory, 550 meters. Okay. So what about this thing? Oh, the bridge is broken. The crossroads. Ah, I see. Those were the crossroads. What's over here? And what are you? The shuttle is currently resting at the quantum moon. The shuttle? Huh? Call the shuttle home. Oh. Activate the gravity can. I can activate this? What the? Ship log hole breach. <laughs> What the heck did I just do? Where did my ship go? Did it just get... Did it just get completely and utterly destroyed or did it get yeeted into oblivion in the black hole? I think it just straight up got destroyed. Gravity, what happens if I do this? Am I going down? Oh, what just, what just happened? What, what is happening? 
Is that the quantum moon? Oh, I see. This again. I have so many questions. You. What are you? You look like a shuttle or something. Like the one I just saw. <sighs> well, that was a trip. And I actually don't have a whole lot of time for today. So I think I'm going to call that episode there. I know. A lot shorter than the others. Um, but... You know, maybe it's better to have shorter episodes. You know, keep you on your toes. Earning... A taste for more. Earning, yearning for a taste for more. Yeah, whatever. You get the idea of what I'm trying to say. Anyway, you know, things are cool. I'm still really intrigued about literally everything. So, I just literally forgot everything I was going to say. Hey, if you like the video, you know, consider sticking around and subscribing. Like, I'm going to have fun with this game. You can watch me have fun with this game. You can probably have fun with this game. I imagine you would. But yeah, like bacon. Stay crispy, my friends, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.